The accident claimed the lives of four people. Why would my father kill them if they were his friends? And on top of that, the explosion led him to financial ruin. That doesn't make any sense. My father was no fool. He wouldn't hurt his own interests. dead man had written about. If he was right, then I'm on the right track. <sighs> I'm running in circles, damn it! I need a clue. Maybe someone's written one down somewhere. Never get out like this. I must find some clues. Dang, people worked here and I don't think they got lost all the time.
light is green again. A little bit of effort, and I can get out of this damn mine. I should look at the map for some hints. Maybe it will tell me where Gilman left the other notes. Look at the map for some hints. He cannot see me. Walter thought my father killed his partner in order to get his shares. But the explosion was accidental. After all, the
death and has to grant an escape for some. Even death fails to grant an escape for some. Even death fails to grant an escape for some. She mentioned some secret in my family, something that could change everything, bring us down forever. What could she mean? Did she know something that even I don't?
Must have been a woman.
Run. If he so much as touches me, I'll freeze to death.
I told you to get out! This is the bottom of some fucking well. But how do I get out? I think it's gonna break. Emma's alone at home. I must get back to her as fast as I can.
I've left my wife alone and there's a maniac on the prowl. I just hope she's all right. Emma! Where is she? Emma. He's been here again. This time, what happened to you? Why do you look like this? I, uh, uh slipped and fell into a stream. I'm all right. He's come back, you hear me? He keeps harassing us. The phone doesn't work. Maybe he cut the wires or... The important thing is, he didn't do anything to you. But he could have. Look what I found. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have left you alone. Did you meet the sheriff? He... Uh, no, I must have missed him. I found the telegrams, though. And believe it or not, the diary I told you about... Diary?! Nicholas's diary. It'll help me decode them. I just need to find the remaining pages and then... You're doing it again! Someone wants to kill us, and all you're worried about is work? Why don't you think about me? About our child? I do think, all the time. Then do something to keep us safe, and do it fast. It'll be over soon, I promise. Emma's on edge, she needs to calm down. I better check what the sheriff was up to. Luckily I've got his car keys. Where did he get that from? An uncle from the KGB? What's this? 
In the late 19th century, the Hyde family, in order to avoid further association with the accusations against Jacob Hyde, legally changed their name to Stevenson. What? What the fuck? Am I supposed to believe that my family and the Hydes are one and the same? That's fucking absurd. So someone would have told me if we had such stories in our family history, wouldn't they? Unless... Unless it's bullshit. Bullshit invented by the sheriff. He wanted to set me up, mess with my head. W was he even a real sheriff? <sighs> Fuck, I seriously can't put my finger on this. Another secret. A hidden room in our house. I have to check it out. That fucker could have even been there when we moved in. Too bad I didn't know about it before. This is it. I just need to place the disc in the opening, just like in the picture. Bingo. That was well thought out, Nicholas. Now I'll just put the apple in the right place. What was that cursed place? What do all those words and symbols mean? Someone's at the door.
Father, why is he protecting me? What is he trying to tell me? What the hell? Secret of the hides. What did we hide? It creeped out at night. But what? And where? I don't get it. What does it have to do with the missing people and the accident? I must talk to that woman. Especially since the detective couldn't write down her testimony. It's been ten years. I hope she's still alive. Here's someone who's not here. It must be the woman who wrote to the detective, Maria. It looks like there's something in the water. Something big. I should stay away.
believed you said he lied, calling O'Hai the cheap shade and a murderer. He cursed me and banished me from the parish. Lord, ye know I ain't lying. Ye know the old man gave me no time when my husband got killed in the mine. Oh, Lord, me that.
Now I can lower the bridge. Self is alive. has lived here for years. The woman claims she knew our family's dark secret. I have no idea what the hell she meant, but maybe there's something left. 
Some records. Anything. I'll search the place while I'm here. Come here! Go away! In the name of Christ, be gone, Satan! Before I leave, I should look for some kind of written record. Maria might have left notes about the events from the past. I just need to make sure she doesn't see me. You will not escape the Lord's punishment. Your sins will be revealed. locked. I can't lockpick it. Mia always has the key on her. Maybe if I'm careful enough, I can steal it from her. You thought I wouldn't know? That I'm just a blind old witch and no one would believe me? Salvation! from their evil, for you know what they have done, for we are one, we are one. Must be the way out, but I should search the house and find the remaining notes before I get out of here. This must be the last note. Time to leave. I can see it. 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 I can
This isn't just an abandoned house. Something terrible has happened here. I can feel it. The evil here is palpable. That woman has been dead for a long time. And she won't rest until she kills me. I must get out of here as fast as I can. I'm not safe here. I need to get out of this damned swamp. What have you seen? Tell me! Who killed those people? Who blew up the mine? What is my family's secret? Tell me! It wasn't old Hyde. The detective was wrong. It was him who killed the devil himself. Wherever there's violence and tragedy, there's you. Wait! Stop! You hear me? If it wasn't my father, then who? And why did he do it? Who is he? Why did he kidnap and murder? What does it have to do with me and my family? Whoever hides behind that mask, this time I can't let him get away. to me now! Stop!
Son of a bitch! I never thought he would do something like that. It's not just the keys and the messages. He wants to get rid of me. Emma, she stayed at home and he's there with her. I can do it. I have to. Uh. What's going on? Where is it coming from? Emma? Emma, are you here? Where did he drag her? Our basement? Why? They went this way. He knows this house better than I do. Who are you? You won't deceive me anymore. We end this today! How is that possible? What's happening to me? Judge Norton, why am I seeing him again? Poor old scoundrel. I never wished you well, Norton. But this... It was him, Jacob. It, it was him. Who? In the mine. That was also him. I'll get you out of here. And you'll tell me everything. Hold on. This way, quickly. Ah! Oh! Oh! Uh! 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 
I told you time and time again, you snot, you can't come in here! This is a job for grown men. They go deep underground, drilling and sweating away in the dark to extract the ore from the earth. You only get in their way! What? Why does it all come back to me? I must. I must get out of here. Do you really want to sit in the dark? Do you like breaking rules? Forgive me, Father. It won't happen again. Where are you now? Up. Sorry, Nicholas. He will be sorry. What? Who's there? We have to help each other. The whole world is against people like us. It's all my fault. No, it's not. It's their fault. And they will pay. Your old man and the others. No, no, no. We cannot think that way. We can do anything. Ever since he said you ruined his life, since he started to lock you up in here, I deserved it. He cheated on her, did you know? And he didn't want her to have you, the most respected son of a bitch in Blackstone. 
Stop it! You're confusing me! It's time for revenge. First, I will fuck up the mine. What do you say? I know where the old man keeps the dynamite boxes. This way. This is my chance. Fucking brat. Father, I didn't do it. Stay away from my inn, Nicholas. Don't scare off the guests. Don't steal from the rooms. But I've never, I swear to God. How dare you take his name in vain. You have no God in your heart, you damned little shit. Said a hustler with a heart of shit. It's not just things disappearing in this inn, but the guests too. You were supposed to help me, not get me in trouble. People are trouble. You will see that when you finally open your eyes. Now it's time for me to open fire. You're back, Nicholas. You knew you couldn't escape punishment. Father? How is this possible? Ah! <laughs> Blew up the mine! Murdered all those people! John was right! Don't come any closer! Stay away! Is this really happening? What's going on? Where's that voice coming from? Is this happening? 
happening right now? Adam! Adam! Emma! Emma, are you here? I must have lost my mind. Just my imagination. I'm hearing things that don't exist. It's just like... There's no coming back. Over. You can't get away. Hear me. You're not going to get away with it. I know what you did. I followed the trail of your crimes. I've been to all the places you've spilled blood. There's just one thing that remains a mystery. Why? That's beyond my grasp. So many people have died. Speak up. Tell me why? The question is, why did you do it? He heard you, I know. And I opened your eyes and then you saw... Your father's reflection in every human being. A world full of beasts in human disguises. No one was innocent. Evil was eating at their consciences like a cancer. And who do you think you are to decide if they deserve to die? They certainly didn't deserve to live. They... Just think about it. Your father's partner, that old crook, desperate to get rid of us. The detective, a vulture, feeding on the tragedy of commoners. Sophia, a miner's widow and a vicious bigot who wished everyone all the worst. And last, but not least, the judge, a grafter, and a regular scoundrel. I've seen worse. Right. Your father, a true role model for that small community. I know they were not good people, but what you did to them... I protected us, don't you see? I saved your life. Or maybe you're just a bloodthirsty sadist who looks for guilt in others in order to blot out your own. You know where you would be if it wasn't for me? In that fucking darkness. The old man would be pissing on your grave, and all of fucking Blackstone would still be full of human vermin. Maybe. But that's not an excuse. I don't need one. The choice is simple. You let the vermin spread, and they will take over the world, or you wipe them out, protecting the righteous few. They will call you a lunatic. So what? There must be another way. Like what? You'll wash your hands of it all? You'll hide from humanity in a fucking cave. You'll fall back into madness like the last time. You'll tell the doctors you don't remember anything. Really? If you get rid of me, they'll squash you like a bug. You think you can just snap your fingers and I'll be gone? I'm the one to blame. I won't deny it. It's time to accept the truth about myself. However terrifying it might be. There's a line now between you and me. You've become my prisoner, and you'd better start cooperating. What are you talking about? What are you trying to achieve? I'm the one asking questions here. Name. 
What kind of sick game is this? Emma, for fuck's sake! Emma. Emma Stevens. Really? Nadia Kamayeva. In the 60s, you underwent training in one of the KGB centers in Russia. Did you or did you not? What? What training? Where's my husband? Adam! <gasps> We've recovered part of the report. Maybe all that she told me was a lie. The KGB called those women sparrows. They seduced Americans in order to relay information to Soviet intelligence. Was I really so blinded by love? Where did you get this? Who sent you? She refused to talk, but she doesn't deny the allegations. What have... what have you done to me? Adam! You! Why? What happened to you? Ten years together. You've been pretending all this time. Adam, what happened to you? Why are you talking like that? Nicholas was my great-great-grandfather. Would you believe it? His diary opened my eyes. You have to be very careful about who you trust. The world is full of beasts. Stop it! You're delusional! It's me. You hear me? I'm your wife. We're expecting a baby. Remember? And war. War creates front lines even in our homes. In our bedrooms. Anyone can be the bad guy. But sometimes... Please. Sometimes it's the one we love that turns out to be the beast. Some... No! Where this life goes away